We sing an old hymn in our country, Jesus, keep me near the cross. And there's a verse in it that says, Near the cross, a trembling soul. Love and mercy found me. There the bright and morning star shed its beams around me. Near the cross, I'll watch and wait. Do you know what we need this afternoon? We need to get back to the cross. Commence the climb! Oh, there's a lot of people are living in the lowland. Where are you living, brother? Are you going up the mountain? Thank God for the climbers, the men that are looking for higher ground. My faith has no desire to stay where doubts abound and fears dismay. Though some may dwell where these abound, my constant aim is higher ground. Let's go up the mountain today. Could I for a moment bring you to the place called Calvary? Could we stand this afternoon under the shadow of the old cross of shame? Could we gaze today afresh upon the bleeding, battered, broken body of God's dear Son? Could we count the thorns in that crown of agony? Could we count the purple drops that fall from his hands, his feet and side? Could I get my soul ignited with the warm passion of that great offering for sin? Oh, men and women today, see from his head, his hands, his feet, sorrow and blood flow mingled down. Did e'er such love for sorrows meet, or thorns compose so rich a crown? And when I stand at that cross, I hate sin, because sin put them in that tree. How can I flirt with sin? How can I companion with sin? How can I take part in sin when I know that sin put them in the tree? As I stand there under that cross, I hate the world. I hate the flesh. I hate the devil. For that broken, bleeding, battered body of Christ is the handiwork of all three. With you, my sins, my cruel sins, his chief tormentors were. Each of my crimes became a nail, an unbelief. The spear. We could get up that mountain today. My, the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of its glory and grace. Come on, brother, leave the lowland. You've stayed there long enough. Come on, sister, start the climb up Calvary's hill today. Let's say in our hearts, we'll go up the mountain. We'll leave behind the world. We'll leave behind those things that soil and stain our souls. And, oh, God, I would more holy be. I would be God's man or God's woman to this generation. I want to be at my best for God. Oh, bring me up the hill. Melt my heart with Calvary love. Teach me the fullness of that blessed truth.